Welcome to session 10 of programming with VB.NET. In the previous session, we discussed about multi-threading, memory management and garbage collection. Various methods of the system.threading.thread class were described and illustrated with help of examples. In this session, we shall discuss about universal data access, managed providers and ADO.NET. We will discuss how ADO.NET can benefit developers in application programming with databases. We will also take a look at different managed providers provided with the .NET framework. So the session objectives are to describe what is universal data access, to discuss about managed providers, to discuss what is ADO.NET and work with ADO.NET. Coming to universal data access. With respect to data access, application scenario today has two emerging needs. They are accessing legacy data or information that is stored in an organization in different formats in various types of systems and accessing non-relational data. The need for the R is to have a single high performance framework or model with the help of which applications can connect to various database products without changing the entire code. Universal Data Access or UDA is one such framework which application programs use to connect to databases from various database vendors through a single uniform interface. UDA is a bundle of various database technologies such as ODBC, DAO and RDO. ODBC means Open Database Connectivity. It is an SQL approach to deal with databases. It is supported by all types of applications. It provides database interoperability which means its method allows data to be exchanged between different databases. DAO means data access objects. It is a desktop solution to access and exchange data among distributed systems. RDO means remote data objects is used for sending data over networks to remote machines and permits Visual Basic programmers to work with relational ODBC data sources. Coming to managed providers. A managed data provider is a set of software program that allows access to databases by providing an interface that performs database related operations on behalf of the application. A managed provider enables us to establish a connection to the database, execute commands and retrieve results, execute commands and update data. Managed providers work jointly with UDA to accomplish all of the above task. Managed providers typically provide the following classes. One is connection class which is used to establish a connection to the database and second is the command class that carries out operations while connected to the database. Coming to ADO.NET. Traditionally an application maintained database connection as long as it executed. This is not feasible as open connections consume valuable resources. Also performance is reduced because of the overheads in maintaining the connection. ADO.NET is a data object model that lets us work with databases version of ADO designed for .NET framework. Data access in ADO.NET is based on disconnected architecture. This means that the connection need not be maintained continuously 
while the application is executing. The application connects to the database as and when it is need to retrieve and update data. ADO.NET provides methods to access data on local databases, client server architectures and the internet. ADO.NET not only allows us to work with OLEDB and SQL Server using managed data providers but also converts any type of data into XML. This feature is very useful for highly distributed applications that use HTTP to communicate between application tiles.